Namaste and welcome to this video. If you are here, you are probably experiencing some neck pain and let me show you a very strict routine that you can follow in order to help yourself relieve any pain in the neck area. Let's go ahead and start from a standing position. Place your feet on the distance of the hips. Inhale, elongate the spine and then with both hands place them on the back side of your head and look down towards your chest and feel the stretch in the neck area. No, um, no additional force is needed here. You just need to allow the weight of your hands to be the additional press on the neck. Stay here and breathe. We will be here around 20 seconds. You should feel some stretch in the neck area and the upper back of your upper side of your back in the area of the scapula. Inhale, release the arms. And now from the standing position, let's start to make circles with the neck. Inhale and exhale back. We will do 10 circles in a clockwise position and then we will follow with another 10 circles in anti-clockwise position. Make sure you only move your neck. And here we got to five and six. Feel the sensations in the area of the neck. Seven, eight, nine. Make sure they're slow, no rush, no hurries, no worries. And let's do the same anti-clockwise. Two, three. Make sure you are align the movements with your breath. Here we came to five. If it feels right, you can close the eyes. Six. It helps to introspection. Eight. Nine. Ten. Okay. So now place your left hand behind your lower back like this. Place the hand and then with the right hand let's Put the palm of the right hand on the left ear and gently let your head go to the right side. We will stay here for 20 seconds approximately. Make sure you breathe and feel the sensations in the area of the neck. Again, no pressure, no push, just the weight of the hand is absolutely sufficient. Breathe here and now just gaze downwards. Let's change the ang angle. Gaze downwards towards your right hip and stay here a little bit longer. And again, if it feels right, you can close the eyes. Inhale, release and now let's Change side, place the right hand behind you and allow your left ear to go to the direction of the left shoulder. Breathe here. Now gaze downwards to your left hip. Okay, release. From here, let's go down on the mat and lay down 
on our backs. Place your hands behind the head and lift yourself up again with the chin pointing towards the chest and stay here for 20 seconds. Slight engagement from the abdominal muscles, but mainly feel again the stretch in the neck area. Release here. Now, rest your head on the floor. Remove anything from your hair, if you have something like me. Make sure you gaze toward the ceiling and don't move your neck to the right or to the left. No, just gaze towards the ceiling. Place your hands on the mat with the palms. You can uh, feel the mat for additional support. Lift the legs up and from here inhale and lift your total body on your shoulders and gently let the right leg go behind you follow by the left. You can here interlace the fingers and pull the arms straight or you can keep them on your lower back. Breathe here. We will be again another 20 seconds here. Make sure the shoulders support the neck and you don't turn your neck to the left and to the right. If this is not enough stretch, you can even bend your knees and hug your head with the knees for additional stretch of the spine. Breathe here. And slowly come out, please. Lift your legs and with the strength of your abdominal wall, release your legs on the mat. Okay, from here we will again go to a standing position or if you want, you can stay in Vajrasana. Choose where to stay. You may continue from here from Vajrasana or if you feel more comfortable standing, you can stand up. So, what we will do from here, I will turn back so that you see my hands. You place your left hand behind your back and the right hand goes on top. Here we hold for two or three seconds and then we change sides. Each side it will be different. Breathe here. If you're not able to catch the fingers, you may bend the right arm and push your shoulder backwards with the left and then change sides like this. Whatever you choose, we should make 10 repetitions each side, ideally holding for minimum two seconds. Here we have three, Elongate the spine, straight back, four, five, six, seven, A, nine, and ten. Now 
release from here. Let's bend the hands in front of us. Make something like 90 degrees ankle. And let's start make dynamic rotations from the shoulders. Clockwise position, we will do 50. And you can increase the speed as per your preferences. 20. 30. 40. 50. Okay, let's do the same anti-clockwise. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty. Ooh, release. Normalize your back. Okay, let's continue. We will now inhale, uh, chin towards chest, and exhale, gaze towards the ceiling. 10 repetitions, and again, we try to make them slowly and feel all the sensations in our neck. Or, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now the same to the left and to the right. Inhale, center, exhale to the right. Inhale, center, left. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten. And now the last exercise, we will inhale and lift only the shoulders, exhale, lower the shoulders. Inhale, exhale. Seven, eight, nine, ten. And with this, we finish the next series. If you really feel pain in your neck, it's ideal that you move your neck until the pain slowly goes down and eventually away. For severe neck pain, if you do this set three times per day, in maximum three days, your pain will be completely gone. For lower discomfort in the neck area, you can apply this set once per day. Very often, the pain in the neck is related with decreased mobility in the shoulders. This is why we include in this set lots of movement and mobility exercises for our shoulders. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel, like and comment here in YouTube, 
and let me know what other videos you would like to see in my channel. Thank you very much for your practice and I will be looking forward to hear from you. Namaste.